Hey everyone, Brian with Aero Teardrops. In this video segment, we're gonna talk about our light leaf drop leaf panel. This is an option that you can add to your steel or steel HC models. Uh, currently in the black finish, this is the 100 watt panel that we offer. Uh, soon we're gonna have a 150 option in this panel as well. So you have your choice when you order your trailer if you wanna go with the smaller 100 watt or the larger 150 watt. Both are really great systems, uh, very efficient, and I'll show you how it works. So right now it's mounted to the hatch, and this is where it'll stay while you're storing the trailer or traveling. There is a padlock hasp on one of the uh, latches here. And we also have a hatch mounted port. So you will plug your panel into this port while it's mounted on the hatch. And what's really cool about this system is when you're camping, this becomes a portable system. So to do that, you're gonna rotate these latches down, these little cam latches, and then you're going to disconnect the panel from the hatch. And now you have a portable panel. What's cool, it has a little kickstand back here. So got your kickstand. Right now it's nice and sunny. So you can set this panel out, angle it to get the best sunlight. And then with this included extension lead, which I believe is 13 feet, you can now plug this into the panel and connect it to the side port here on the trailer. And the side port is also included with the light leaf system. So we've got two ways to connect the panel to the trailer. And this just saves you from having to reach up onto the hatch and, and connect it there. And then to attach it back onto the hatch, you're just gonna repeat the process. This slides up into some brackets up here. Lock the cam locks. And, and connect the panel back up here to the port on the hatch. The solar controller for the light leaf system is gonna be mounted in one of two places. If you have the classic cabinetry like this trailer has, the controller will be mounted here in the galley cabinet. And this is a 10 amp um, controller from Zamp. Gives you the status of the charge. You can also set your battery type here. You can view amps or voltage. Right now it's getting almost four amps. And you can tell by this progress bar that it's getting a pretty good charge just mounted to the trailer. Saw it hit 9.9 .9 amps there, that's pretty good. If you have our new cabinetry, this controller is going to be mounted in the cabin of the trailer. 